you have to let go. There's some things in this life that you just cannot control that are just above you. Some problems are only problems that God can handle. And it's up to you to be able to take a step back and let go. And by having faith, you give up that anxiety that you have that it will be taken care of. <clears throat> that it'll be all right in the end. This is um, something that I've really had to get into my head and drill it into my head every single day. Because when I wake up, every day is a new day. You know, like I always say, when you lift your head off that pillow, yesterday is gone and all you have is today, right now. So everything that I've been dealing with recently in my life, all these struggles, you know, unforeseen events and any any sort of inconvenience in my life, I, I just really have to analyze what can I control and the things that are out of my control, I really just have to give it up to God and that's something that I've really had to work on is my faith and my ability to let the things that are above me that are out of my control be you know, up to fate, up to God's will. Because, you know, as someone who feels like they never really had control in their life, I try to control as many things as I can because I don't want things slipping away. You know, opportunities or whatever bad things that happen, I don't want it to be, you know, on me. I don't want any, I, I want to minimize the suffering in my life, my family's life, my friends, everyone around me. And when things go wrong, I have to just, you know, do what I can. But at the same time, realize that I cannot control everything. And that's a big lesson that a lot of people need to understand and implement is, you know, your anxiety comes from your want to control the things you can't. And that really is what kind of cured my anxiety, is not really dwelling on the future, is, is not being worried about the things I cannot control because a lot of things are out of your control. And, uh, you know, this, this uh, week, these past two weeks, a few weeks really, you know, I've been sick on and off dealing with a lot of things, uh, family issues, business issues, a lot of things really aren't going the way that I planned or hoped. So, you know, I've been doing my best to control the things I can and work my ass off in every aspect of my life and just let the things that are out of my control really just play out because, you know, whether they get better or whether they get worse, the only thing that I can do is try my best. And, um, yeah, I've just uh, been growing a lot recently and uh, really trying to put myself out there to uh, take, take all the opportunities that are given to me because that's something that I really regret. And I know a lot of people have regrets about letting opportunities get away. Because when you get older and you look back on all the opportunities you missed out on, it really haunts you. But that's another thing is the past. You cannot dwell on the past either. The present is the only thing you can control. And once you can kind of stop thinking about the past, stop thinking about the future, you will have no choice but to be present. And that's all you should really be worried about. You know, in the grand scheme of things, I know it's good to, you know, plan ahead and learn from your mistakes. You know, take that very lightly, though. You know, I'm not someone to really plan ahead and uh, map out. I've never had a clear path in my life. Uh, all I've really done is just be anxious in the future. And that's something I've learned 
is to, uh, you know, not worry about it because whatever happens, happens. All I can control is what I do now. And what I'm doing now is building myself, building myself, building the people around me and trying to create that future that I envision because anything that comes along the way is just a test. Everything that I face, everything that you will face, whether good or bad, is a test to see your your decisions that you make, you know, and it really is, uh, really is hard to kind of detach yourself from that controlling aspect of your life. Like if, if you're like me and you really kind of had to grow up and face the reality of the world. You want to try to control every aspect of your life. But you can't. So all I'm trying to say is you really need to have faith. Have faith in yourself. Have faith in God. And just control what you can because there's nothing you can do you know to the things that are out of your control just do your best and stay blessed alright guys I'll see you in the next one